Hey guys, it's me, Sam, back with another video, and today we are talking about the Horton Challenge. The Horton Challenge is a really big meet, and I had a lot of fun, and it's our last meet before ETC, so let's get into it.
280, Overall, Horton was a lot of fun, and I didn't do my best, but I also did better than last meet, so uh, it wasn't too bad. I had a few falls and a few mistakes that I didn't need to make, but it was really fun meet. We were in this giant like arena, and everything was on podium, which means basically there's like stands and then the piece of equipment is on top of that. Uh, and it was all brand new Spieth equipment, which is good, but also bad because Spieth equipment is really nice. It's uh, one of the nicest equipments, but when it's brand new, you're not ready to actually do anything on it. So like the equipment all being brand new made it very hard to compete on it, especially since we were like the first session. So everything was really hard to do. Uh, the bars were weird and stuff, but it was a lot of fun to be in that arena. We started on rings, which I don't mind starting on rings. It's usually one of my harder, like it's usually one of my worst events. My routine was going so well. It was up until my dismount. It was like the best routine I've ever done. And then I put my hands down on dismount, which was a really dumb mistake that I didn't need to make. We moved on to vault. I didn't do my double fold this meet. I just did a full I guess the podium or something something messed with me and I wasn't able to do the double full. P-bars is like the hardest event to do with brand new bars because there's zero chalk on them. But luckily, we were able to make a spot on like one end of the bars, which was really nice. And that's the end I did my boss R on, uh, which my boss R was really good. But then the other end of the bars where I do my tapelt was very, very slippery. So I just did a regular moy. And my routine, I hit, it was much better than mile high, but there were a lot of like handstand shakes that I just need to fix. So my P-bars was really good, just need to fix some handstand issues. High bar was pretty solid. There wasn't anything, any major mistakes. It was very similar to my one at mile high, but they were judging a lot harder at this meet and they just took little deductions on like every skill. So just need to fix those. We got to talk to the judge and the judge let us know what we need to do to fix. So I'm gonna take that to practice and fix it on high bar. But overall, happy with high bar. The floor was the only event that wasn't Spieth. It was AI. It was really weird, the floor. Um, I didn't really like it very much. I mean, I had to compete on it anyways. So my floor routine, uh, my first pass was pretty good, my front double full. And then I did my full in and I landed a little bit short and put my hands down. Went through the rest of my routine, had some big steps, uh, almost fell on my triple full. So that was a rough floor routine, but it's all right. We moved on to pommel and my routine was going so well. I got all the way to my Magyar, got past my Magyar and then fell in the circle out of it, which I really shouldn't have. I should have <laughs> made that, but my routine was still a 12-3 or 12-3-5, which is really good for pommel. That was second place, but if I could just not fall, <laughs> It'd be much better. And my pommel's gotten a lot more consistent other than Magyar. I just need to fix that or change it or something. Overall, the meet wasn't wasn't too bad. Had some issues that I need to fix before ETC, but it was a lot of fun competing in the arena. So we get one weekend off and then we go to Kentucky for ETC. And this is like probably the biggest competition of the year because it's for the t for a team. Nationals and US championships are big, but they're just for myself and like qualifying for uh national team and stuff, but this is uh we're competing for the region team. So that is going to be a lot of fun. Uh if you guys liked this video, please like and share with others so we can continue to grow men's gymnastics. And remember, if you're new here, stick the dismount on that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>